Hey, pre-notification gang. Thanks for the resub, Ublahu. <sighs> Hello, the resub operator. I know Master Duel came out today. We'll be playing it later. Thanks for the resub, Minji. Thanks for the resub hoodie strings <clears throat> in the prime slope. <clears throat> in the prime gamer clown. Thanks to Reese of Andrew Merritt. No, we're not doing YouTube tonight. Thanks to Reese of Keelan. Yep, we'll be playing Master Duel in a little while. Is the Prime Tree Loop. Master Duel's amazing. Yeah, I've heard almost nothing but good things. And then a lot of people complaining about, like, the rule set. Because it doesn't use TCG, the most recent TCG rule set. But since I don't know the most recent TCG rule set, that's not going to bother me. Easy resub Sabatino and tier one Matt Mobiles. You hear about the drama? What drama? What's going on today? Thanks to the resub Snivy and the tier one Dovahkiin Devon. We finished LA Noir. The Ninja Pokemon drama is already two days old. Thanks to the Bits noob. Is the prime DQ? I don't know if I'd make something on it, Nady. I'm not sure. I haven't decided, but yeah, I did finish it. No, I had no idea that he made one and deleted it either, Nady. Thanks to resub Blunder and Red Dead. And the bits voob. Yeah, we'll do Master Duel in a little while. There's the Prime Stealth Point and the Resub Hoops. And the bits interesting. D Storm and Otter. And the Prime Mustache and Resub Wash. Nope, I haven't tried Master Duel yet. We're coming in fresh tonight. 
in a little while. I guess they Brogan. That does sound pretty wacky, but sure. Glad you're feeling better. And thanks for the bits, Nathan. And there's a reset bat in the prime grease. Hey, Chase. So, actually, here, let me just look it up real quick. What is this whole thing with APX? Is that what it is? Let me look it up real quick. Aplex. What is that? Things of the Prime Justice and the Resub Butter, Tanuki, and Pirate. And the tier one Apollo and the resub is Schmegel. It's an Indian company that scams. Yeah, I just typed in their name on YouTube here and all it is is about how they're copyright striking everyone and apparently have been for three years. Why Aplex gives you copyright strike. So why is this trending on Twitter all of a sudden? Like, why am I getting so many emails about it? Things the tier one. Torture and the prime interesting and the resub beefcake, Zane and Mallow. And bits Barry and Big Suck and resub Giovanna. Yeah, I'm excited for Master Duel. Like I said, we're gonna be doing it in a little bit. Thanks for your sub, Tommy. No, I don't know much about that goblin. And thanks for the bit stack. Hey, congrats on getting the job, Emperor. That's fantastic. No, it's not YouTube night. I just keep getting tons and tons of emails about Aplex. And I saw it was really big on Twitter, but I didn't look into it. <clears throat> Things of the Prime Joe and the resub Xeroxius. And then the resub Cheaty and Tier 1 Sir Peterson. Whole chat saying the moon actor died. The Moon Knight actor? I saw that in the chat earlier. What the fuck happened today? That's the first I've heard of that. How did I miss all this? What? A skiing accident? Holy shit. He played Anton Mogart. Is he a, was he a big character in the show? Next is the resub Sean Piggly Edible in Tier 1 Jack. Damn, that's fucking awful. He played Midnight Man. Jesus. Things the prime steaming load and the resub hidden and sleepless. We did YouTube night last night, so it's not gonna be tonight. Thanks to the bits Apollo, Nathan, and Fishy. Thanks to resub Mars. Close to 99 agility. Lit I haven't been training it. I literally haven't touched it. It's so fucking boring. I'm still 84. I hate that goddamn skill. But I'll, I'll push through at some point. Just not, not yet. Thanks to the bitch water. 
Thoughts on what type of deck you might want to play? I'm going to make a ton of goofy decks. I'll probably make like one or two meta decks and then a lot of goofy ones. Thanks to the resub Blazon, Tier 1 Optimus, Gift Sub Chris, and Resub Clutch. Thanks for the bit socks. Magical socks. God damn it. Thank you for the 10k bits again, Suicide. Thank you, man. Jesus Christ. God damn. Thank you. So is this an interesting story? Like, is there a lot to it? Or is it just a shitty company abusing the system? Is the recent Purple Venom in Lando? And resub Cilantro. Shitty company abusing the system. Okay, so it's not like a, a wild story. Just... Corruption. He's a tier one jade. In the prime. Dova Kiki. And tier one Rick Roll. Yep, we'll be playing Master Duel in a little while. Apparently a lot went on today that I did not know about. So the Moon Knight actor was skiing without wearing a helmet. And then unfortunately got into an accident. Thanks to the bitch the medium. And the resub Jojo, hey man. Favorite tactic in Yu-Gi-Oh? I guess IRL Yu-Gi-Oh would be like reaching over and tickling them. I'd play like a real life stall deck where I just genuinely interrupt their turn physically. So then they'd time themselves out not being able to play. Thanks to resub Pegasus, Sad Boy, and Darkness. And the resub Courage and the Bits Nathan. Thanks for a long time watching, Apollo. Yep, we'll be doing Master Duel later. And thanks to the resub Ugly and the Prime Boosh. I'd love to get Steve Harwell on the podcast. He's the Tier 1 Captain Tortellini and Tier 1 Sully. Tifa Lockhart interrupted a Zoom call. Ooh, that was a cool story. Can't play it on stream, and I wish the video was longer, but yeah. Final Fantasy Porn interrupted a Zoom meeting. It was pretty cool. Ooh, thank you for the 10 gift subs, Robert. I appreciate it, man. Hope you had a good day. And thanks to the resub, don't do much, and Capybara, and the bits, Fuza. Thanks to the five goof subs, these nuts. Yeah, I'm surprised Philip didn't cover it yet, Nady. Thanks to the resub, Bing. And the resub, Lexicon. Thanks to the bits Zumba and Itamimi. And the five gift subs D Storm. Thank you, Storm. Nice Zumba. And thanks to the bits Saucy. We're not doing YouTube tonight. I was just wondering what this situation was here, so that way people don't get confused. Right now we're just hanging out and I'm learning about a bunch of shit I missed. We did YouTube last night. Thanks to the resub TJ in the Prime. Knocked in the resub, Nick. Thanks to the tier one saucy grannies and 10 gift subs again, Robert. Thank you, Robert. Thank you, man. Let's talk about Ruben Sim. I already did. 
There hasn't been any new updates yet. He won, kind of. And that's where we're at in the story. Thanks to Resub Dakota and Devi. And the Resub at Cisco. Yeah, we talked about Microsoft buying Blizzard yesterday. I think it's a good thing for Blizzard games. And Bo Bobby Kotick is stepping down, apparently. So I think overall, great news. About the only thing that could save those games from that spiral downward that they were experiencing. What's the point in caps lock spamming something that I've already answered? You're clearly just not even listening, man. We've talked about Ruben. Made a whole video about the most up-to-date Ruben information against the Roblox. Why do you keep fucking asking? The gift sub eyes in the resub Mia, Fangu, and Tier 1 Laser. And the bits Dops. Have you collected any more Pokemon cards recently? Nah. It's been Yu-Gi-Oh for me. Thanks the resub Noah. And the resub Aloha. There's a new Pokemon set coming soon. Well, there always is. Is it Prime Schmeckle? Tifa is trending on Twitter now after that. Good, she deserved it. And that video seemed awesome. The Italian Zoom council meeting was lucky to have Tifa getting butt fucked on screen. Thanks, you said Bust a Wolf. Yep, we're going to be doing some Master Duel in a little bit. Thanks to the Resub King of Hearts. And Prostates. Yep, finished Breath of the Wild. Didn't stream the ending or anything, though. The backseating was just too much. Thanks to the Gift Sub Cleed. Yeah, the Cuphead show I thought looked cool. Didn't maintain that same art style from the game, but that was never going to happen. It's too expensive. Thanks to the gift sub Kazi and the resub Watermelon and gift sub TBG. Yeah, of course I'll watch the Cuphead show. I love Cuphead. Do I want the source of the Tifa video? Nope, not really. Thanks for the gift sub. Love Yana. Roblox themselves is getting sued by who? Let's see. I don't see anything about that. Sounds like a rumor. Thanks for resub tomato and valentines. Yep, we'll be playing Master Duel soon. Thanks for resub Jess. This is there's been a lot going on today apparently that I didn't know about. Thanks to the gift sub, Funtin and Prime Wonton. I'm excited for Dying Light too. Thanks to Prime Vex. And the resub Doctor Whom. Yeah, I know all about the Drake hot sauce condom. <clears throat> it 
It'll come perplexed. You just gotta give it time. Feeling on the new Pokemon game? I think it's gonna be boring. Everything they've showed is just like an empty, barren world. And your only quests are go collect some stuff and bring it back. I don't even think there's a story to it. They haven't shown shit. I love the idea of it, but god damn, it looks boring. Can you play Rogue Company? No, I never even tried it. Fortnite? Oh, I heard they brought Dilted Towers back. I was very tempted. You know how much I love Tilted Towers. Plan today is some Master Duel in a little bit. And just Master Duel. But I'm not ready for it yet. No, I didn't pre-order Dying Light 2. It's the Prime Aussie. I rarely pre-order games. In fact, I don't even remember the last time I pre-ordered a game. Of course, I get Breath of the Wild 2. And thanks for the bits, Nathan. I haven't played Traveler's Rest. Whew. You're on a billboard? Why are you ignoring that? What billboard? Where at? Oh, you're talking about on billboard. As in the top 100. I thought you meant like on a physical billboard. <laughs> oh. Uh, the only reason I even figured out what you were saying is because when I typed that in, it brought up the album. I see. Yeah, that no, was fucking crazy. So all of the album sales got calculated from Evolution of Tears, and we've peaked at number 22 globally for all albums, all genres. I think we're just behind... Fuck, who was it? Let me look. We beat twice and the weekend, so that was pretty nice. What album? The Evolution of Tears. Oh, where's it at? Where's the charts? When's the next YouTube night? Bro, we just did one last night. So, maybe in a few more days. Oh my god. Navigating the internet sometimes is just a fucking hassle with adblock. So many websites just stop working. <clears throat> oh. Let's see. Oh, here we go. I think I'm on. Nope. It immediately, it immediately just stops me from accessing it. I can access it on mobile, but not on desktop. Shame. Thanks to the Prime Yo-Yo and the recent Deer Butt Phoenix in Nuclear and Trill Seeker in Prime Zero. How does that work? The album came out half a year ago. The album came out in September. That's not half a year ago. But yeah, I guess it just takes a while to calculate everything. Uh, can't say I'm overly knowledgeable on how it all works. But I am very excited to see it there. It's fucking awesome. Thanks for some pumpkin and Presidente. And the resub Echo.
when you're making a new album. We're already cooking up some new songs. Doing a lot of wacky ones. I think there's a wheel. Do a live show? Uh, maybe if COVID ever dies down. How's God Slap? Animation's done for the club scene. Issue one's almost done. So hopefully like another two or so weeks. The main problem was we got really held up switching all the shipping and fulfillment. So that stalled the entire process. Thanks to the bits, Echo. It was alright, Nathan. Didn't do much today. Thanks to the Prime. Bereal Man. Do you believe in aliens? Oh god, yeah. They're out there, but I don't think they're gonna be hot. They're gonna be ugly as fuck. They're gonna look like weird little insects or something. Thanks to the resub super and tier one spooky and tier one DeSeuss kid. I think Microsoft buying Blizzard is good. It's not like Blizzard was doing a good job with their games anyway, and Bobby Kotick is a fucking menace, so I think it's an overall good thing. I disagree with that, but to each their own. Well, hopefully just with the first part where you don't think the Blizzard games have been getting shittier. And not that you actually like Bobby Kotick. Thanks to the two gift subs, DeSeuss kid. Bobby Kotick is an actual fucking criminal. You can disagree though, if, like if you don't think the quality of the games have gotten worse, that's fine. I'm not going to fight you on it. It's not like I've been playing Blizzard games actively for a while. For me, they all lost their luster a while ago. What games, Naruto? Okay, I guess I'll have to check that one out then, Nady. Thanks for your Glumsy. Oh, the GameStop video about all the studios Microsoft owns? We can do that on YouTube night. What happened to Diablo Immortal? I, I don't know, man. I have no fucking clue. What's the point in even owning a phone if I can't play Diablo Immortal on it? Thanks for the resub roadkill. You see Master Duel came out? Of course I did, man. We're going to be playing it in a little bit. Do you think Bobby Kotick will be fired? It's already been reported that once the deal closes, he's stepping down as CEO. Which is basically getting fired. He's being replaced by Phil Spencer. Thanks to the resub pwn in Tier 1 Dofo. You still going to hold Jump Force hostage when it shuts down? Yep. Still got it queued up, baby. Yeah, it'll be on Friday, Banks. The restock will be on Friday. Thanks to the resub, Erebos. And the resub, Tickle Me, Jalmo. They say that the brightest candle burns half as long. Yeah, rest in peace, Jump Force. 
We'll have to hop on before it shuts down for good pretty soon. Just to remember all the good times we had with it. Thanks to the resub critical in tier 1 Sterling in the bits homicide. Thanks to the resub Brink. Why is Jump Force shutting down? Because the game's trash, man. No one plays it. It's a bad game. Thanks to the gift sub Nathan. I wanted it to be good so bad. It never had it never had a chance. For some reason, all the anime games that they pump out are always just the same game every single time. When they make a game about an anime, it always ends up playing and being almost exactly the same. It's either going to be a Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm clone, or it's going to be a, um, what's the other arena fighter? The one that Jump Force was like. Like, the One Punch Man was like it, the My Hero game was like it, Jump Force, what the fuck is that? What is that one called? There's a name for the for No, not, not the Xenoverse formula. Is it the Xenoverse? I don't really remember Xenoforce. Yeah, J-Stars. The J-Stars formula. Yeah, J-Stars. That's what I was thinking of. It's either ever... It's always ever just going to be Ninja Storm style or J-Star style. Thanks to the five gift subs. Left Nut and the resub Devil Me and Shady Pigeon. Thank you, Left Nut. I think the five gift subs, Red Panda. Thank you, man. And the resub, Gogana and Devapathy. <clears throat> Oof. Plan for tonight, keep getting caught up with world events that I've missed today, and then some Master Duel. Attack on Titan game was pretty good. Admittedly, the Attack on Titan games were pretty good, yeah. Those were different. And I also liked Kakarot, but that wasn't really, like, different. It just, I thought it was fun. Thanks to Prime Akira and JP. Thanks to the Tier 1 Ryo Mare. And the resub Justin. Hey Justin, hope you're doing well. And the resub Ravioli. Update on the Pokemon and Ninja drama. There is no update, man. As far as I know, they they haven't gone to court yet, unfortunately. So we'll have to wait and see. I think the big spectacle of it is over. Thanks to resub Matt PD. I don't remember. I really don't remember Xenoverse very well, so I don't have an opinion on it. What do you think Microsoft will manage the lawsuit against Activision since it's their problem now? Uh, I don't know, man. They'll probably just be like, "It was Bobby Kotick." Just point the finger at him. He did everything. He was the one stealing the breast milk out of the fridge. He he covered everything up. Get him. That's what I'd do. That'd be cool, numb, but probably not. Thanks to Tier 1 Zobro and the Prime Mike. Do I like Cacti? Yeah. That whole thing was about stealing titty milk? Jesus Christ, no. It was a fucking laundry list of horrible things that happened at Activision Blizzard Studios. That was just one goofy one. I see you said painted. That's just a rumor. I mean, it's a little different when it's in legal writing with multiple people making the same claim. I wouldn't necessarily say a rumor. But yeah, it, it was an accusation against them. I 
Thanks for the resub. I did two gift subs, a little too. I'm not like a big cacti guy. I don't know a ton of different cacti breeds, man. I still like new metal. I still listen to some. Thanks for the prime. Wesley and the resub skilled. I can feel the disgusting shit brewing. So that might be the plan. We hang out till I have to shit. I'll go shit and then we'll do some master duel. So what else did I miss today? You like Deftones? I love Deftones and that's why I feel so bad about the P.O. Box video. Apparently that first shirt with the horse and the D on it was from the White Pony album, which is my favorite Deftones album, but I didn't recognize it at all because on the album there's not like a giant D. So I had no fucking clue what I was looking at. Yeah, I felt I felt horrible when I read the comments. Cause I love Deftones. Thanks for the resub, Olat. In the prime Rammy. What's your favorite Deftones song? Change. Change is one of like my favorite songs of all time. I think that song is so good. Marvel resident sleeper. I yeah, I don't get like excited for Marvel shit, but it's always just good. The new Spider-Man was like actually hype. And Loki was really good, but I don't know. Overall, it's just it's hard to get like pumped for a new Marvel anything. I started Hawkeye, and it's like it's not bad, but super generic. Is it Prime Mini Fox? Yeah, Sleeping Dogs is a game we're going to replay at some point. I've been watching Peacemaker. I like Peacemaker. I just finished episode 3. It's fun. Again, it's not like great, but I do like it. At the very least, it's not like Marvel shows. So I can appreciate that. Is the resub festive him? I know there's a new slot fight. We'll watch it on YouTube night next YouTube night. CW shows are the only quality thing on TV. Can't tell if you're being sarcastic. Thank you, Tier One Wessie. Sure, Cacti. And thanks for the bits. Usain and Resub Gluten. Yeah, we watched Moon Knight trailer last night. Thanks to Resub Writer. Have a good night, Nathan. Would you play Infamous? Maybe. I didn't really like Infamous when I played it when it came out. Maybe I'll like it more as an adult. Have I seen the new Lord of the Rings teaser? Uh -uh. Let me see. It's the first I've even heard of it. Amazon's Lord of the Rings series finally has a name and a plot. <clears throat> Centers around the... Oh, boy. <laughs> <coughs> Woo! Thanks to Reset Disclosing and the Prime Insidious. 
centers around the 20 rings mentioned but not explored in the original trilogy. It's set thousands of years before the events of the trilogy. Well, that's cool. The series cost an estimated $465 million to create. Holy shit. God damn. Thanks, you said David and Miguel. Thanks, man. I'm sorry to hear about that. That's fucking terrible, David. Hope you and your family are doing all right. Yeah, I just heard about the uh, Moon Knight tragedy. Thanks to the resub, ZG. Dar man ripoff made a video about a racist. Yeah, I saw the racist Karen with the whipping stuff. Yeah, that shit was crazy. What tragedy? Midnight man from Moon Knight passed away today after a skiing accident. Thanks to resub, Fireside. See, I wasn't the only one that didn't see that today. That that was like not big on Twitter. So I did. I had no idea. Thanks to the tier one sand dragon and the resub Jack D. Of course, I'll be streaming Elden Ring. <laughs> Wait, maybe I don't have to shit. It might have just been a fart. No, I'm not sure, Raccoon. Like I said, it might have just been a fart. I'm not positive. I think it's the Prime Schlong. I think Microsoft will fix COD. I think there's at least a chance. I think it's the resub, Kevin. Alright, let's do some Master Duel. Thanks to Resub Chris. I've been pretty hyped for this game. And from everything I've heard, it's good. I also have no idea how to actually play like Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG. I only know how to play Duel Links. So I'm gonna get my fucking ham steamed. This is cute. Oh yeah, I participated in the Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links uh, KC Grand. I made it to the second stage. I'll just say, like, yeah, I'm a current player. I know how to do all that. Thanks to Tier 1 Berlizzi and the 10 gift subs Berlizzi. Thank you, man. Thanks to Yusub Kwani and Static Seduction. Thank you, Berlizzi. So I have to do the tutorial? Okay. Little do they know they're dealing with a veteran here. Hey, let's just do the whole tutorial. Fuck it. Yeah, why? Why not? I'm not gonna skip it. It won't take long anyway, I'm sure. You get free cards from the tutorial? Yeah, see, I'm making the right call in. Where's settings? Is this settings? Thanks, a resub, Cole. Oh no, this is like the activity log. What's this? Oh, there it is. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Thanks, the reset bell. You need to play the Bloodborne D-Make? Is that actually gonna be a game you can play in public? Or what? Well, Jesus. The public can play? The Bloodborne D-Make is out right now. Jesus, really? God damn, okay. One and oh, baby. Here we get some platinum. You can skip tutorial and still get rewards. Can you? Someone said you have to play them to get the cards. You can skip? Okay. Oh, yeah, you're right. Thanks to reset Frankie and Epic and this and the Bits Again Suicide. The music is loud. Alright, I'll turn it down. How familiar with Yu-Gi-Oh are you? I played Duel Links all the way up until KC Grand Tournament Stage 3. I got knocked out in Stage 2 and then I quit on the spot. I really wanted the prize card. Um, I don't know how to do Pendulum or Link Summons though, those never hit Duel Links before I quit. I'll do this. I recognize these cards. Just give me this. This will be a cute throwback deck anyway. Leaves the prime grace. Alright. Um. What's a cool duelist name? Thanks to Reset Lund. Oh, that's pretty crazy, Goblin. Ooh, these are all pretty good. Cream Pie Okerlund. I wish. It's only 3 to 12 characters. Cream Pie Okerlund's too long. Also, couldn't do Wily Shitterman either. Riley Reed would fit. Thanks to Prime Sam and the resub Wiggle. Bobby Kotick. Red Solo Cup's pretty cute. Keep his legacy alive. He may have lost in slapping, but he'll never lose in dueling. Things to give some schmoody. And they give the five gift subs Philly. Thank you, man. Hmm. I'm leaning towards either Riley Reed or Red Solo Cup. Both classics that we haven't used in a long time. Milkman. <laughs> cool. Not sure yet, Raccoon. And thanks to Risa Benzo. Alright, fine. 
We'll bring in Red Solo Cup. I'm fine with that. Whoa, what? What is... What's wrong with Red Solo Cup? It, can I not do spaces, maybe? Is that legal? Oh, uh, okay. He's banned from playing this game. <laughs> yeah. He's already been blacklisted by Master Duel. He's the resub username in Poo Poo. I'm really excited for this game, unironically. I really hope for, uh, like, future, they have different ranked ladders for different formats, so they could have, like, a GOAT format ranked ladder and shit like that. I think that'd be great. GOAT formats, like, everything, I think it's, like, up to 2010. Goat formats up to 2006. Maybe I'm not thinking of goat format then. I thought the one was all the way up to synchro, but not past. What format is that? Because I actually like synchro. I think synchro is a pretty decent addition. I never had a problem with synchro. Edison. Edison format. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks for sub teriyaki. So how do you get cards? Is it like gotcha? So from everything I've read on Twitter today, you buy packs and then you can- it's like Hearthstone, you get packs and you also get gems. And the gems you can use to create whatever card you want. So you use the gems to make your specific cards you need for your deck. Your packs can become gem fodder. <clears throat> At least that's how I understand it. Yeah, it's basically the Hearthstone system. Not ideal, but it could have been a lot worse. If I was in charge of Konami, which I never would be, uh, it, but if I was, I would have ran this game as a subscription. So it'd be $10 a month, you get every card ever made, and then when you introduce new cards into the game, then you could like maybe introduce packs for it, right? I think that would make sense. Either a sub-model or like a one-time fee for every card and then charge for packs in the future, I don't know. There's just so many other ways to do it. It's really cheap, nothing like Duel Links. I did hear it's a lot better than Duel Links system. Easy resub retro retro GM. My favorite card, Strike Ninja. I always liked Strike Ninja. Card's actual dog nuts, but it was a really cool card. Thanks to Resub Utter Socks.
Strike Ninja had competitive play. Did it really? What the fuck was its effect again? There's something with banishing, and I don't remember what. I think it gives some sweet stuff. Easy tier one, mucho mango. Oh yeah, banish two dark monsters to banish itself until end phase. That's what it was. Thanks for your sub chomper. Thanks for the bit salamander. What's the rarest Yu-Gi-Oh card you have? Ghost Rare Misprint Rainbow Dragon. From Tactical Evolution. Or I also have a first edition Legend of Blue Eyes. Or first edition Legend of Blue Eyes, Blue Eyes White Dragon. I have every single Yu-Gi-Oh card that was ever printed, first edition. Ultra Rare and above. Every single one of them. How do people still not know this? I, I made a whole video going over the collection. I finished it like three months ago. Now I just keep up with the new sets in order to keep it complete. I framed like all the ultimate rares, all the ghost rares, the starlights, the collector's rares, and then all the other ones I put in binders. What's the most OP card? I think it's the True Draco, Master Draco of Peace or some shit. Something like that. I think it's the resub purple in Prime Cross Flame. No, I can definitely understand where you're coming from, Nady. Oh, I didn't even see this finished. I'd right, have to check that out and then decide. Uh, I'm not going to purchase any gems yet. I don't think I'm really ready to be surveyed here. I haven't played yet. Alright, so I got the Power of the Dragon structure deck. Let me see. I might just come in raw and see how it feels. Just improvise. <clears throat> Thanks the reset. Munchie, Amateur, and... RX. Do solo mode for cards. Let me see if I can get a dubski with this deck. I know most of these cards. I bet I could squeak one out over someone online. Let's see. I'm sure I could at least beat one kid's ass here. Fucking staying up late on a school night to play some Yu-Gi-Oh, have a little fun, and I'll blast them with a starting deck. Make him uninstall. Got tons of packs just from doing tutorial, took no time at all. I will do it, I just want to see if I can get a win here with this. Quick text message.
this isn't the deck I thought I was using, so <laughs> we're uh, not in a good spot. I only have normal monsters in this deck. Oh wait, no, I played Unexpected Die. I can only summon a normal monster. We'll be fine, we'll be fine, we'll be fine. This dude's also probably playing with dog shit. Let me just turtle up a little bit. We'll, we'll be we'll be fine. We'll be all right. All right. Let's see what he's using. Thanks to resub loose key and the gift sub faithful. Oh, your cam's blocking card descriptions. Yeah, hey, I'll move it in a minute. Yeah, I'll do it now, actually. While we're waiting. There. I don't even know the Fluffle archetype, but I can tell you it's not in the, uh, 2002 format deck that I'm using here. Yep, well. It'll be fine, I'm not, I'm not concerned, really. Now you're blocking life points. I don't even know where the fuck I'd put my card then, or my cam then. It's gonna block it everywhere. Top left. Yeah. Things to give some toxic in the prime kitty and McMuffin. Oh, I know Frightful. Or Frightfur. I should be fine. We'll be we'll be alright. I'm not going to get OTK'd. Chat, now it's blocking card names. I mean, yeah, like I said, I don't know where the fuck I'd put it, so... I mean, do you really need to see card names if you could just read the description? Why does the name matter? It'd be fine. If I do bottom right, then I block this. If I ever use this, I guess. Okay, we we'll do bottom right. Please read some Novlux, Giraffe, and Tennis. What do you just play? What did you just do? This? It's fine. Oh god, this guy's going, he's really going in. His turn is taking six years. Yeah, so when you... That's one of the things that I don't really like about most modern Yu-Gi-Oh! matches. It's all combo decks for the most part, and setting up your field takes literally, no exaggeration, five to ten minutes. Like, it it's, a, it's a long process. And then I always have the, the option to, like, resolve or uh, respond, so it just takes so fucking long.
He's a resub, Ursa. Ursa Lyoth. What? I, I don't know what Cardi just did in the graveyard there. That uh, uh, Let's check the, the action replay. All right. Pretty good, pretty good. Well, shit. We'll be alright, I'll get him with the structure deck. He only has one in his graveyard, right? Can I check his graveyard? Oh, here we go. He only has one, so we can do this. Here I come, pussy! Yeah! Let's go! I'm kinda popping off. Man paid $400 for his Fright Fur deck, only to get slapped around by a free starter deck that they use to make fun of kids. Shit. What's this do again? Yeah, it's alright. Thanks to the bits elemental. No, I already finished Dying Light. No, I never heard of that elemental. Thanks to Tier 1 Olivan. He didn't spend a penny on that fluffle. Yeah, I don't know how it all works yet. Apparently it's really free-to-play friendly, so he very well may have not spent any money. And there is nothing in my deck that will actually attack over this. So, this is probably where it ends for me, boys. I made him bleed a little bit, though, with this. Shot a couple spitballs at him here with the starter deck. No shot, this is free to play friendly. Apparently it is. You get a ton of packs from just doing the solo mode. I saw a lot of people on Twitter talking about it. I know I can toggle off, it's like dual links, but there's no reason for me to do that. It's not enough. Even if I did use that and save the 800 for next turn, it wouldn't be enough. Heart of the cards, let's go! We live to fight another day, boys. Do I have a- do I even have Synchro in my extra deck? I have Mighty Warrior. My man, stop sweating so much! I am playing the starter deck! Jesus Christ! Well... I'm not going down like no bitch, I'll tell you that much. I'm staying in it. We fight to the very end.
Click on the rescue rabbit. Yeah, they have little cute animations, I know. He's got his whole field set. I don't know it. I don't know what any of these do. It doesn't matter. I mean, there's nothing I can do here. All right, we'll do solo. Actually, get some cards and then try and fight. This starter deck did not get it done. Thanks to resub Miski. He's a prime sloppy. Oh, true, I wanted to use the dragon deck. Okay, one more with a starter deck, and then we'll actually get cards. See how many cards we get through solo mode. Too many mechanics, Jesus. I think that's what makes Yu-Gi-Oh! unique. Yu-Gi-Oh! has so many moving parts compared to other card games. And I like that. It's just, I wish it wasn't all combo-oriented, because then the turns just take too long. Like, each one of this guy's turns has taken no less than four or five minutes. Things are resub. Suhesto. This deck is bad, this isn't meta. Fucking meta slave. I know it's not meta, man. I know Frightfur is not top tier. He probably just likes Frightfur. I'm gonna make a lot of not meta decks. Yeah, I'll be playing Sifu. Yeah, this guy really activated 100% of his brain to just beat one face-down monster card that has a dog shit effect from the starter deck. He's over there crunching numbers and combos in his head. What? Let me draw into a smashing ground. Jesus Christ, give me smashing ground. This I can win. I can win! Gee, oh, fuck! It's alright. Turtle up. I can still win. This guy doesn't even know how to play Yu-Gi-Oh! He nuked his own field. And missed lethal. No! He's the prime space in tier one Tinji. In the tier one Johnny. Alright, now let me actually put on the dragon starting deck and see how that goes. And I still ranked up. They recognized the fighting spirit and rewarded me for it. Good. They recognize a real duelist. Yeah, let me save that one to the highlight reel. Alright, let's go. Now we get serious. Get the pass. Yeah, man, I will in a minute. I just want to see if I can win with one of these starting decks. Mm. 
There are bonus packs containing one staple card guaranteed. Oh, good. Okay. So it looks like this is just a stall deck. What does this one do again? Um, okay. <sighs> Alright, maybe... Maybe just double defense draw <laughs> and pass. Uh, there's no point in using Komodo right now. Like, I don't need to even set him down. There's also a good chance this guy just DCs. He's already struggling. the Prime Riot and the Resub Mars. I just don't really like Subnautica, Subnautica style games. Thanks the Resub Wooby. <clears throat> yeah, I imagine Dark Magician or any kind of Spellcaster deck is going to be the most common deck right now. Maybe I should have also set Threatening Roar, to be honest. It will be- we'll, pro we'll probably be fine. He, he doesn't know what he's doing. Thanks for your sub Tartarus. I don't know this deck, but I do know Pendulum Magicians, kind of. I've seen it. Oops, didn't mean to skip the animation. I used to give sub tampon and the resub dad mox. Nice. Very good. Okay. Yep. Good. Very good. Nice. Excellent play, sir. Good tits, my boy. Oh, I don't know what's happening, but there's so many monsters. Maybe he'll deck himself out. Nice. We're looking good. I've got him right where I want him now. I should have just set my Komodo at this point, just to fucking survive maybe, give him another target. If I had played Threatening Roar, we'd be totally good. Uh, yeah. Thanks for the resub, Stotty Boy. Jesus' turn lasts forever. 
Yeah, you have 435 seconds. And in Yu-Gi-Oh, that's just enough for one combo. Thanks to the reset ace and strings. How much did this guy pay? I don't know, man. We'll have to see how free-to-play friendly it is. Do you think Yu-Gi-Oh! is more complicated than Magic the Gathering? Yeah. I'm not, like, super deep into magic, but Yu-Gi-Oh! just has so much text, each card has so much different shit, whereas magic has it much more streamlined. I think magic is, like, the better designed card game, but I really like the complexity of Yu-Gi-Oh! I just wish it didn't end up like this, where the turns last forever. There's a resub Caesar. All of that and he didn't have any back row removal? We might just be okay. I mean, I don't know what any of his cards do. But I guess we'll see. Oh, why did I do that? I should have waited. I didn't even see what he attacked with. <laughs> I blocked the two weakest. <laughs> Alright, time to get serious. Okay, alright. I don't think there's really much I can do. My fusions are Five Head Dragon and King Dragoon. So, you know. Here I come. Well, hold on. Yeah, I mean, I'll at least go down fighting. I, I don't know if he has like a redirect or something, but I'm coming for this guy. I don't feel like reading all of these. Let's go! We're making our comeback. So then I can threatening roar on this next turn. You know, maybe not all hope is lost. And then I draw into another threatening roar. And I stall the game out until his internet crashes. What does this do? Things are resub cougar. And the resub ice pro. Wow. 
I don't know what that does. No, oh, he's adding a spellcaster. Uh, I think I'm just gonna use this. Just now, preemptively. I don't know what he's gonna summon, but I don't want it to be like uh, anything that'll cuck me here. Okay. Oh, I see. This is a continuous trap card. I thought this was going to be like a Karibo where you play it and you don't take battle damage for the rest of that. Or for the next attack. Oh, no, it's not continuous. We're good. We're good. Oh, we're good. Yeah, no, now you just can't attack. That stood up there for a while. I thought it was just going to stay. Thanks for the resub, Lin and Chad. I think there's a good chance he times himself out. So he's got his scales back here, he's gonna lose track of time. I think we're good. I really do. Thanks to the resub, Riley. I know that card got banned, right? Halifibrax. It didn't? I thought it did. Didn't people whine about this card all the time? Oh, the Synchro one did. Oh, maybe that's what I'm thinking of. Is it tier 1 meaty? What battle phase, idiot? I played Threatening Roar, you moron. Fucking imbecile. Watch this. Give me another Threatening Roar. Let's ruin this man's day. Great. Feels good, feels good. Um... You know... Yeah, I only have one real play here to, to stall out a little bit. Can I attack into this, or just some kind of inherent protection? Hey, I know that card. the resub Alessandri. Here I come. I'll swing into the heavy metal, maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna swing into heavy metal. Another 200, baby! We're coming in! Bro, this guy doesn't even know how to respond! Thanks to Prime Gumbo. I've got him right where I want him, too. If I could just draw it into my blue eyes and somehow throw it away, we've got a chance. Or maybe a Foolish Burial if this deck has it? This whole mechanic actually ruins the game. I know everyone hates Pendulum. Well, at least, like, old school players, I suppose. But then there's also the Pendulum Best Deck meme. Is it Prime Dang?
Old school players hate everything? Eh. I just don't like how long the turns last, man. Everything's too combo oriented, it just takes so long. It's just playing your full deck on turn one and then turn two if the response isn't enough to like negate. If you didn't have enough hand traps, it just kind of ends on the spot in modern TCG. I don't know about this rule set. Apparently this rule set's more fun and less combo oriented, but I don't know. Hey, Coder. This rule set is 3 max C, which auto ends any combo, combo deck's turn. Oh, that's cool. You enjoying the game? Well, I've only played the starter deck. And the last 40 minutes has been in this one duel. This guy's <laughs> just taking forever. Which is exactly what I'm talking about. Like, combo turns are way too long. That's always been my main complaint about the TCG. It's not over yet. Here I come. <laughs> and take this. If I draw a Threatening Roar, I'm going to be so happy. Just when you thought it was safe! <laughs> I'm not done yet! I will waste this man's time. I swear to god, I'm going to make him so upset. And we live to see another turn, baby. Threatening Roar. Threatening Roar. Let's go. Stall him out. His internet's shit, he could literally DC at any moment. Just threatening roar and we're good. Damn. Take this! Oh, oops. Well, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to activate, but whatever. He's got to have less than 100 seconds left on his timer. I'd be very curious to know how much time's left on his timer. You honestly could have finished an entire League of Legends game just in the time he has been playing this duel. Imagine if I drew into a Regeki. That would have been the shit. Well, it wouldn't have mattered. He's playing Pendulums. He could have summoned the next 40 cards. What's the timer start at? Four, uh, 480 seconds, I think? No! These are some T-Bros. Alright. Starter deck. Both starter decks. Not very good. Though I am soaring through the ranks right now. Okay. Let's see how free-to-play friendly this is. Oh wait, someone said click on missions. Shit. Long. Okay, okay. 
Oh, and there's claim all the rewards. Nice. Alright, here I come. Let's farm. Things we give sub Atlanta and the resub T Bros and Ghost in Tier 1 Angelo. Favorite card, Strike Ninja. He's a prime, no brekkie. monster so I can't use that. Yeah, because it has to be an effect monster. Alright. Thanks for some Shuby. You fucking idiot. This goddamn fool. What are my synchros? No, I also have Link monsters. Just two plus monsters and I can summon Gaia the Lightning Shadow. So I can't synchro this bad boy. Okay, let's try a Link Summon. I've never done that, so let's get... I think I'm gonna hold on to this bad boy. So I think I'll just do this. This is how it works, right? I just need two monsters and I can Link. Oh, this one's two normal. This one's just two or more monsters, and this one's three monsters. Oh, this is the cost? So then this one's just too normal, so I can link that. What? So you need three total for Gaia. Yeah. So it doesn't really seem worth to even link this guy here. Why would I Blade Knight? Blade Knight doesn't get me over this. I think for now I'm just gonna turtle. I don't wanna think too hard. Thanks to Primo Sama. So you have fodder next turn? Fodder for what? I don't just... It only gains 400 attack when I have one card or less. I could just start tossing meat at this guy and go for it, I guess. I don't know, this whole deck is nothing but normal monsters, it seems. I should have just used this, just gone for free. I still might. I might just link this off and let him attack me and take this card back and then just swing at him because it's just a tutorial guy. Is 
The other starter decks are really cheap in the store. Yeah, it seems like they are. What's your game ID? Red Solo Cup. That would have been kind of cool. Alright, let's do a Link Summon. Just in case it's three different monsters. Let's do that. So what's the point of the arrows here if he doesn't have an effect? Thanks for the five gift subs, Bung. Appreciate the generosity, man. And the prime meek and the resub magic. You can only summon other link monsters to the arrows it points to. Gotcha. Finish Dying Light. Thanks the Prime Daydream. <clears throat> Whoa! The OST is so good. OST does kind of slap. Yugo got Han Zimmer on the track. Free Regeki, nice. Ooh, where's my dragon deck? Yeah. This shit was even worse than the normal starting deck, but I'm about it, let's ride. being pretty cool. Thanks for the gifts of extreme. Ring of Destruction is banned. Is it really? Nice. <clears throat> it's not. Oh. I'm getting all kinds of mixed info. Wait, what is... Oh. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> you son of a bitch! Damn, this guy's good. Man, 
Eh, yeah, might as well use it. Fuck this guy. Take this! The special bond between man and cardboard. No! Unironically, I, I really needed that card out there. <laughs> that way I could actually fusion summon something useful. Is what it is though, man. Exit Prime, Tardis, Sternus, and Midnight. You play the PS1 Yu-Gi-Oh game? I played almost every Yu-Gi-Oh game on like the consoles back in the day. No! <laughs> this guy is good! <laughs> what deck are you running? It's the Dragon Starter Deck. The Power of the Dragon. You sick motherfucker! No! Here we go. Now we're coming in. Best duelist of all time. <laughs> Thanks to the Prime Kendrick and the resub Mach and the two gift subs Extreme. Take this. Sorry, kid. Surely he doesn't have another 2,000 plus defense- Oh my god, I actually might be able to- I might be able to do something, finally! Alright. What is King- Wait, what? Why can't I use my fusion substitute for King Dragon? Dragoon. What am I misunderstanding? Using monsters, you control the fusion material. Oh, it's okay. I thought for some reason this acted like the um, hex seal guy. Uh, it doesn't. Damn. Well, here's hoping I don't lose the Lord of D. Otherwise, this is gonna get a lot more tedious. Bro, the starter deck is so much better than the Power of Dragon deck, I shouldn't have even bothered. At least I could have Link Summoned or something by now. I can't do shit with this. Here I come! Got him right where I want him. Thanks to the resub Roba and the Bits Mango. I already know that thing's got fucking 3,000 defense. We're so close to just being able to five-headed dragon. We're on the cusp. It's so close. Exit tier one kill prime. Yeah! No, wait! It's a six star monster. I have to tribute for him. 
I can't five headed dragon. This will still be fine though. Let's go! He does piercing damage. Suck my dick! I'm the best duelist the game's ever seen! Okay, back to normal starting deck. That was fucking rough. Power of Dragon is some dog ass. That is not good. That actually hurt my feelings. Thanks to the resub shapes and the gift sub brooks. Clearing practice mode gives you 2400 gems. Yeah, I'm just gonna blast through it. I'm not worried about it. <clears throat> He's a tier one mic. No, I haven't done much gamer score shit in a while. Thanks for the boost, idiot! Oh, wow. Oh my god, is he gonna XCs already? Oh no, we're good. Time to get serious. What, what do I have for my XCs? Doesn't seem worth it right now. Thanks to Elusive, what deck are you looking to build? I'm gonna build a lot of goofy ones. I think for my meta deck, I'll probably do Burning Abyss. Two attacks, though. Yeah, but I can just attack with both of these guys and be fine. I, I'll be alright. Because these are not normal monsters. Yeah, these aren't normal monsters, so they get a boost. No, it wasn't because of Farfa, it's because I love the art of Burning Abyss. I just really think the Burning Abyss art is super good. It's so unique in the world of Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu-Gi-Oh cards are like anime, waifus, big titties, spellcasters, dragons, and then Burning Abyss is Dante's Inferno. Like just like actual realistic looking demons. These are the prime set. The resub dunk. Nice big moves. I'm on my way to King of Games already. Is the archetype based off Dante's Inferno? It is. So they have like Dante the Burning Traveler, Dante... I don't know, the... They have a bunch of like Dante cards in the Burning Abyss archetype. And it's pretty cool, like they... I think it just is a really cool archetype. He's starting to pop off. Is this game on console? It is.
Wait, why can't I attack again? Did I already attack twice with him? I, I don't even remember now, actually. Things are prime shrimpy. Oh, it needs to be in a row? Oh, shit. I should have read that, I guess. Yeah, you're right. You were not wrong. We're coming in! Things are reset Jack in the Prime Eclipse. Whoa! Whoa! I'm just too good. I've got a I've got an answer for everything. I truly am one of the best duelists to ever play the game. Get out of here, pussy. It'll be a thousand years before you're ready to face me. Is this game beginner friendly? I don't know, man. What were your SAT scores? Are you in like the top percentile? Because if so, yes. Here's a Prime Blizzy in the resub Misty Dream and Prime Lemon and resub Sneakers. Hold on one second. Oh my god, thanks to Resub Extreme. This is gonna bother me for a little while. This is gonna sound fucking weird. But what is the word for, uh, like, when you're unable to have kids? Not infertile. It's, uh, fuck, what's the other one? Not sterile, not infertile. Impotent, thank you. That's the word I was trying to think of. It, may it doesn't make sense to me asking here, but it made sense in the text message I just sent. Give me one sec. Okay. Thanks, Resub Samoth. Impotent means very, very low chance of having children. Yeah, that's the word I was looking for, though. I already know how synchros work. Let's go! What do I want? Oh, hey, Junk Warrior.
dice. Just three more practice. Oh, this will teach me how to do Pendulum, won't it? This will actually be pretty helpful. Sleep well, Dirt. I know how to XCs. Exit Tier 1, Professor Sin. finished inscription. It was super good though. I really liked it. I'm gonna really fuck this man's ass. Hitting him with a big 4k. Activate his effect. Please attack with a monster. It's begging me. I won't attack with just a monster. I'm attacking with a god. Take this! Thunder Dragon's broken in this game. It has Colossus. I don't know Colossus. I know Thunder Dragon and Duel Links, though. That's actually how I climbed to stage 2 of the KC Grand. I just used Thunder Dragons. There's the Prime Lyric. Okay, this I have no fucking clue. God damn, that sounds so strong. This is just a normal one. This boy magician has the gift of seeing natural lines of energy that run through the earth. What a lame power, I can see energy lines. Yeehaw. Let's go. So where's the pendulum effects? Oh, well these are normal so I don't have pendulum effects. Oh, it does have one. So if I have a magician in my other pendulum zone, so this... I can discard a pendulum from my hand instead of summoning it, and then take a card, blow up a card, okay. And then this one is a back row removal, nice. Thanks the bits kill prime. Alright, last one. Link summoning. I also don't know how Link works. Well, I kind of do now. Chat told me. So now I can only Link summon to Link zones that my Link summoned monster points to.
Alright. Arrows can give effects too. Okay. Backup secretary inbound. So I don't want to summon this, because I've only special summoned right now, but I guess I need to link first. I think link summoning is a pretty cool mechanic. Definitely better than pendulum. So far, Pendulum seems a little wacky to me. So my first Link Summon has to be in the Link Zone. So I think, obviously, the Link monster you want here is going to be one that points down. Or I guess up if you have effects against them. a normal summon, right? Because I can't put it over here and he doesn't point down. Okay, so a Link 2 monster... Okay, I'm starting to figure it out. This card seems pretty good. Thanks to resub squid. I know at least uh, at least they're from Duel Links. I know the invocation class or uh, archetype Jesus. Firewall Dragon Pre Errata here. Uh, thanks to the resub Alfonso. Are you liking the game? I am. I've only played uh, two, well, three duels online using Starter Deck, and it's Starter Deck is trash. But other than that. Starter deck is starter deck like an every Yu-Gi-Oh game. Hey man, don't shit on Duel Link starter decks. Like uh, some of their structures they came out with actually kind of fucking slapped kids. Do kids even play Yu-Gi-Oh anymore? Of course they don't play Yu-Gi-Oh anymore, man. Just look at Pendulum Monster text. It's literally three fucking paragraphs. It's like doing a book report for kids. Of course they don't. What do I have in here again? Oh yeah, might as well. Eh, nah. Actually, there's no reason to do that. Hmm, but maybe. Maybe just go into Gaia? Nah, no, I don't need to. I'm sure this guy's just gonna be a steamroll. Well, 
I made the right call. Can't click Link's Wholesome. Tell me what it is, though. Thanks for your sub, Melvin. No! Betrayed by my own card! This may be the best duelist I've ever seen. Well. Okay, not much I can do here. Well, might as well use this on that guy over there. Suck my dick. Sorry, nerd. Can I draw into a monster, please? Let's go! The heart of the cards! All I needed to do was ask! What does this one do again? <clears throat> oh yeah, let's just let's link this. Seems like an overall not good card, but for here it'll be fine. Things the bit wholesome. Tin taxidermy. Oh, top tin taxidermy. Gotcha. Jesus. Oh, copycat. Thanks to Reset Psycho Christ. What kind of deck is he using? Uh, you wouldn't understand. It's a tier zero deck. Oh, here I come. Let's give it to this guy, who cares? Just for those of you wondering, I set the unexpected die because Blade Knight gets an extra 400 attack with one card in your hand. It was actually a strategic play from the uh, masterful stylings of Duelist Red Solo Cup. Everything I do has a purpose. A higher purpose. I just wanted to call attention to that in case any uh, imbeciles were in here wondering why I did that. Thanks to Resub Hedadios. Oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be an easy one. What is this do? Oh, field spell. Let's go. Exciting. This guy's nuts! Oh my god! <laughs> Get him out of here! Get that bitch out of here! Set the shield crush. Play the blade knight. He gets an extra 400 attack because there's one card in my hand. I'm a genius! And then I go in. This could be this could be the new meta. No!
Luckily, I haven't answered everything. I need to hold on to Ballista Squad so I keep that card in my hand for the boost. And it's a game. With his own card. The ultimate insult. Every duelist's worst nightmare. Betrayed by the thing you trusted most. Straight to the Shadow Realm. Opened up with a little bit of a dog shitty hand. But a real duelist can work with anything. Even if I didn't have any cards, I'd still find a way to win. Only an amateur duelist relies on cards to win a duel. Thanks the resub, Jackster. Now you'll notice one thing I did is I didn't play any trap cards in this zone just in case Fiendish Battle is using an infinite impermanence. I'm always thinking 20 steps ahead of my opponent. That's what separates me from the trash. Oh, he's not ready for this. Synchro summon inbound online. Wait, what, do, what is my synchro? Oh yeah, this is worth. Brace for impact. Do I have a graveyard effect? I thought I saw a graveyard effect. Get out of here, idiot. Enjoy that 400 damage. No! He's thought of everything. Need to reset by Zaya. Man, I should have just set Call of the Haunted. <laughs> nice, huge slap on him. This will be super comfy on mobile. Is it on mobile? I don't know why I did this. I could have... Whatever. I'm actually thinking five steps ahead. It's going to be on mobile soon. Gotcha. Easy game. Thanks for resub squeal. You can right click your mouse instead of clicking cancel. Oh, that's huge, I had no idea. Alright, I think I'm finally done with all this. Oh, this is just one gate? Oh no, that's, that's definitely it. 
Oh, 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 I see, I see. I see how it works, okay. <clears throat> Things are sub Eldritch and Trance. Um, instead of just doing all solo, maybe I'll do... Maybe I'll actually try and build a deck now. How many gems did I get from all that? <clears throat> Let's see. I have 6,400 gems. How much does a stalwart force for a single pack is 100. All of them are 100. Get the bundle first. Is that in special? Oh, it's the dual pass. Uh, I imagine dual pass is probably worth, right? Worth it? Okay. Okay, now let's grab this. Alright, let's open some packs, baby. I'm feeling good. This is gonna be a good one. Hey, who was that? Was that a Megazord? Oh, I actually got Nel Shadal. This isn't the good one, though. I want the uh, El Shadal Construct, right? Uh, this card might be good, but the Construct's the one I know. Oh my god, look at it. Look at this huge pull. Are these all legendary cards? Ultra rare? Super turbo secret rare? Starlights? Woo! I just got a ton of super rares. That's helpful. It, oh, I'm nuts! Let's go! What does Ghost Belt do? I know most of the Ghost Girls are good. Okay. Oh, it's gonna be a fat one. I, I already feel it. This one's gonna hit hard. Well, okay. Hey, this is from uh, Blazing Vortex. I have the starlight of this one. Er, wait. Yeah, this is Blazing Vortex, right? You going to bed? There you go, come say goodnight in a sec. Oh, I thought it was a guaranteed ultra rare in every pack. What kind of garbage? No ultra rare, I want a refund. Oh, back-to-back -back stinkers. Yucky. Oof. Oh, this is a good one, though. This is a good one. Come on. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a fatty right there. I don't know that card. It seems alright. Oh my god, what is going on? Where's my streamer RNG now? What kind of dog shit? Oh, I like the look of this. Well. I know this guy. I have uh, the ultra ultimate rare of him. I think, yeah, right? He is an ultimate rare. Oh, this is a big one. The biggest one ever seen. Why? What? What are these huge animations for nothing? They're going to be hyped up for actual turds. 
What is going on? There's something at least. Alright, back to back super rares, I'll take it. Is Evil Eye any good in the TCG? Oh! No, it's bad. Cool, I'll make it then. Thanks to reset cam naked cameraman. What's the best value here for a pack? Oh, this is a... Is this gonna be dinosaurs? Dinosaurs are nutty, right? I'm doing dinos. Oh, I unlocked them all. Oh, okay. Well, I'll, I'll wait on that then. Here I come again. I only unlocked them for 24 hours? What? Tough. There we go. That's a good card. I know that one's good. Sky Striker's very solid from what I know. Oh, there's gonna be another really good one. Yep. Come on, show me something good! Yes. I'm really starting to get in the groove now. Mm-hmm. Hey, Magician of Black Chaos. Wow, this has been a really good set of packs so far. Hey, there's something. Exit Prime Nova. Secret packs are great. Oh, I know they are. I can already tell. Oh, that's nice. Good, we needed that. What does this one do? That seems good. Build dinos? I might- Oh! I bet that's gonna be the best card in all of Yu-Gi-Oh! The Strike Ninja. Well, shit. Uh, this card seems like ass. Damn. Alright, we got some other packs in here. Nice. Free lightning storm. Well, not free. But a lightning storm. Good. I'm coming in! Give me some big fucking meaty monsters. Nothing but ultra rares. Shit. Shit. Surely I can't get nothing but awful cards for all tin packs. There we go. Well, no, that still seems kind of bad. What is this? That might be useful, I don't know. This is awful. But at least he's a shiny piece of shit. Yeah, 
Man, this has not been going well here. Good god, oh my lord, how many times am I gonna get slapped in the mouth? Oh god, oh my lord, stop! Did she stop? <laughs> it's hurting! Why is Konami spitting on me? Oh! Oh god, stop! Please! Oh, there we go, this is gonna be a good one. Finally, I needed it. Alright, come on. Contact C. Oh, hey, this is kind of like the Disciple of Ra. But it seems easier to get on their side of the field. It's bad, is it? Oh. Thanks for your Pyro and Hawk and Caucasian. Alright. Well, at least we got a little something. Alright, so I'm out of bundles. Omega's good? Okay, cool. Oh, these are the guys on the side of the board, right? I really think this game has a lot of potential. I'm super excited. It's probably worth to get the structure decks just to get the cards out of them, right? So should I just get both of these? 30 minute duels kind of resident sleeper though. I feel like what'll really help is if they had different ladders for... It's a waste? Okay. I feel like if it would really help if they had different ladders for different formats. So a ranked ladder for GOAT, ranked ladder for Edison, shit like that. So that we could specifically play in what you want. I feel like that would be the solution, because, yeah, I know a lot of people don't like pendulums. So if you could just go to the ranked ladder that doesn't have pendulums in the format, that would be really solid. Alright, let's do some secret packs. Um, I thought it would be fun to build ninjas. I know it's not like a meta deck, but it's what I climbed in Duel Links with first. But I didn't get any secret packs that seem conducive to that, so I'll probably just do dinos. Yeah, I think we'll just do dinos. Or El Shadal. The Shadal cards look cool. What, what would chat rather see, dinos or Shadal? I'll do either. I think both of them look fun. Seems more for dino. Alright, we'll do dino. Thanks the bits tampon. It's not too personal, and not really tampon. Let's go! Damn it! Son of a bitch! Toon archetype is still trash, right? Thanks for resub shard. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Here we go. There's gonna be a fatty. Well. I feel like it only plays that animation when it knows I'm not getting anything. These cards wouldn't even allow me to, like, pay someone to spit in my mouth. And yet it gives me a huge animation for it. Every time. Literally every time. Oops. 
Oh, was the baby dino good? Was that like a combo starter? Hey, wait, the double evolution pill is good, right? Yeah, this one's good. This one has to be huge. I mean, it was an ultra rare. Thanks for the bits, Fran. If you craft an ultra rare or secret rare from the ninja set, it will unlock the secret pack manually. Okay, I'll do that right after this. Check out these huge pulls, though. Ultimate Conductor Tyranno, easy pull. Okay, and then the Tyranno, yep, alright, cool. Awesome. I'll still take it. Okay, so where do I craft? In deck builder? Okay. Oh, right, my missions. Wait, let me do that first. This is a tier one mas master comp. Did I just get, yeah, 4,000. I thought it might have been 400, but yep. Another 4,000. <gasps> More packs! Let's go! The unhealthy obsession continues even online. Thanks the resub unknown and devil man. Okay, so... Do I just... Wait, this is going to be the cards I already have. So where do I search for cards to create... Oh, this is just cards, like, everywhere? Oh, okay. Uh, let's do Hanzo. Is Hanzo meta? Well, oh, I know ninjas aren't meta. Is Hanzo still, like, a staple in ninja decks? Yeah. Okay. So then to craft him, do I generate this? Thanks the gift sub derp and the resub Nuka Cola and Prod. No. Just one. Then it unlocks a secret pack. Okay. What is this generating from? Like where did I get this? Does it automatically dismantle dupes? Or well, excess of three? Oh, I got this from missions. Gotcha. Okay. Then let's get one. Okay. Come on, baby. I love titties. Hey, my man. Amen, brother. This one's for you, the titty lover. All right. Well, we still have titties at the end of the day, I guess. There's the Prime Cat and the Resub Headley and Prime Infinity and the Resub Arizona. And the prime slowpoke. I'm gonna go say goodnight to Tiana real quick and then fill up my water. I'll be right back.
I'm fucking back. What's going on, you rapscallions? Thanks to the resub blubber, the prime bigo, and gift sub chubs. Oh. And the 10 gift subs Maki, and 5 gift subs Crumple, and 10 gift subs Maki, and tier 1 Luke. Goddamn, going a bit wacky. The AFK strat. And the 20 gift subs Crumple. Thank you, man. Jesus. Thank you for the generosity. Thanks to the Prime Toy Boat and the resub Kate. Thank you, Crumple. Oh, huge pack! Yeah! Oh my god, every time. That's actually crazy. Why even give me the animation? Why do that? Here we go. That's more like it. Nice. I don't know what that card does. Son of a bitch. I do know Yellow Ninja, though. Thanks for resub Shrooms and Logan. And the bitch Sean and McChuff. And the Prime. DJ and Pixels. And thanks, McChuff. I don't know Blue Dragon Ninja. Damn, is the ninja archetype, like, rogue tier? Like, is it almost viable competitively? Because it seems to have a ton of support. I haven't heard of half of these cards. No? It's dog shit? No. It'll still be fun. I'll bring ninjas back. Thanks to the resub trash panda and gift sub grim. <laughs> Thank you for the 20 gift subs, Maki. Thank you. I appreciate the generosity. Thanks to the bitch raccoon and Luke. Hey, bonus e or bonus pack. Is this free? What is this? Thanks to the gift sub lover shrooms. It gives you two old school cards. That's cool. Yep, very old school cards. I remember uh, Triple Star Treon from back in the day. Yeah, that was cool. That's what I was hoping for. Awesome. Uh, bah humbug, I guess. Let's do an El Shadal 10 pack. I'm just kind of mixing and matching everything right now. Thanks to Prime Zang, Zanchi, and Gift Sub Raccoon, and Resub Maruma, Marumao. Oh, hey, wait, that's good. Damn, might have to do El Shadal. Oh! Oh, let's go! I know Wind is kind of nutty. And then it's, uh, what's the other one? What's the other one I'm looking for? The Construct, and then something else. Yeah, maybe we'll just do El Shadal. We're getting good pulls on it. Ooh, 
Ooh! Double Ultra Rares. I'll take that. I don't know either of these. Well, I know Junk Destroyer. I don't know the Supreme King. Dinos and Shadal go together? Oh, perfect. Maybe what I'll do is I'll make like an actual meta deck first and then build up enough gyms to do ninjas and like goofy off meta shit. My Shadal pulls have been great so far though. And it continues, baby. Oh my god, we are fucking popping off on the Shadal box. Oh, and they're all glow- Oh my god, every single card is glowing! I've gotten at least one super rare in every single open- or every single pack. Is it tier one Bobil? Streak continues, baby. We did it. At least one super rare in every single pack in this. That was huge. And I've got Pendulum Secret Packs now. Damn. Uh, let's let's ride the momentum a little bit here. Let's uh, let's chase the dragon. Let's go another ten. See if it holds up. Oh, we're still in it. Oh, another schism. We are still streaking. I'm nuts. My RNG is going fucking wacky! Huge! I don't know what the fuck that is. Another schism! I have all three schisms. <gasps> I'm gonna be the best Shadal player the game's seen. Day one, I'm gonna have the perfect Shadal deck. Fucking nutty! Bro, these pulls are mad. Thanks to the five gift subs, Headley. I appreciate the generosity. And the kid oh my god, the streak continues. No! It was broken. I think we got 14 packs with a super rare in every single one. Oh yeah, it's making it up to me though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, baby. And, oh, man. This is this is so nice. Bro, I've, like, enabled cheat codes here. No, still, streak is... Oh, the streak was broken, but we're still doing well. Thank you to five gift subs. Old Gersty, thank you for that. Uh... Maybe, Mason. I really wouldn't be the one to do that, though. Makes a bit dread. <gasps> Two constructs. You don't usually run three constructs, do you? Isn't it two? Two's meta? You do run three. Fuck. No, uh, chat's divided between two and three for what's meta. Yeah, fuck it. I'll just pull another construct just to make it easy. Then I could just have three and not worry about it. See, and there it is, right there. No! <laughs> Yo, let's go! I'm tapped into the mainframe. <laughs> oh my god, pulling cards is an art form. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. It's not random. Oh, that felt good. Oh my lord, my pools are crazy! Uh, 
Oh, we're still going! I remember this card being pretty solid for its time. I don't know if it still is. This card I know is pretty fucking good too! Let's go! My deck is gonna be nuts! I haven't spent a dime yet! Maybe this game really is super free-to-play friendly. Let's keep riding this El Shadal momentum. I don't even know what else I need. I need another window, right? And I think that's it. These are five gift subs moves in the bits top ten and moves again. Okay, well you hate to see that. <laughs> now I'm not having any fun. <laughs> A rough start. Okay, the well may have run dry. Tough. I got nerfed. Yeah, shit. Okay, well, this was bound to happen at some point. Yeah, tough, 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 tough. God damn it. Oh, wait, here we go, here we go. Ugh. I don't know if that card's any good. Just need one more window. Come on, come on, come on. There she is! Uh. Okay, hold on, we're starting to streak a little bit. That card's pretty good. I don't know if I needed two, though. I don't know that one. I just need one more window, come on. Don't be mean. Is she hiding? Nope. Oh, god damn it. Is this free to play? Yeah. I haven't spent anything. I literally haven't spent a single dollar on this, and I've already got most of what I need for El Shadal. That's kind of a cute feature. Hey, loser. We noticed that you pulled nothing but dog shit. So next time you do that, we'll guarantee you at least one card that won't make you sad. Craft it. Craft it. What do you think I am, a coward? Watch this. I just need one pack for it. Check it. Give it to me. Tough. By one, I meant two packs. Now I'm locked in. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'll craft it. Let's do some dinos now. Exit Prime, Bumblebutt, and Resub Swoogity, and Chronicle. Get the Ultra Rare first. I don't need to though. I already have every. I have three of every other Ultra Rare, don't I? I'd have to double check, but I think I only needed one more window, so I don't see the point. I know this card's very good. Well, at least it was last I checked. Oh, get the Ultra Rare for the Dust. Oh, smart, smart, smart. Oh, let's go! Wait, why is Zeus in the Dino Pack? My pulls have been fucking crazy! And yes, I have the Starlight version of Zeus, of course. In real life. Zeus is limited to one, is he?
I don't know if this card's actually useful in the TCG, but I actually really liked it in Duel Links. Thanks for the five gift subs, Mighty Me. Appreciate it, man. Moist Esports competing in Master Duel. I actually think it would be pretty fun. It just depends on what kind of support Konami is going to give to Master Duel. I feel like this is the best possible attempt to bring Yu-Gi-Oh back like into the mainstream. So it's not just like more of a niche card game. Because I think they've done a great job with everything so far. They just need to actually support it going forward. Okay, let me get the Ultra Rare then. Where's the... Where'd it go? Did I get banned from opening? Oh, there it is. Exit Prime. Cesis. It's crossplay too. Yeah, like I said, I think they did everything right so far. From everything I've seen and read about and now have played, it seems like they just did pretty much all of it pretty good. Here's your sub kizzy. Is that the window right away? Oh my god, I have so many schisms. Alright, that's fine, I'll take it, fuck it. My El Shadal luck is crazy. I'm pulling absolute fire. And just when you thought it was gonna be a stinker, I still got a super rare out of it. Quintet. I like Quintet. My Switch can't handle this game very well. The only games the Switch can play is really like mobile games, and even then it struggles sometimes, man. It, like, don't... I wouldn't say get it on the Switch. I wouldn't say get anything on the Switch that's not Nintendo. Just get it anywhere else, man. Come on, just one more window. Is this cross-platform? Yeah. Thanks to the resub Hydroid. Thanks to the resub Chew. That's gotta be the window. Damn, I don't know what this one is. This seems pretty good. I think it's a prime top 10. Oh, this is a big one. Come on. Son of a bitch. Thanks for the resub, Scudlord. Oh, one of these has got to be Winda. Finish strong, come on. Why? 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 Well, I mean, all right. Well, now I have three of that. All right, I'm just gonna have to craft Winda. That's fine. I actually didn't pull any of this, did I? Is this card any good? Hopefully I don't need it for anything. I'm not gonna read all that. Thanks for some wolves. It is. Yeah. Thanks for some mousetrap. I don't need it for Shadal back though, right? 
Okay, I have 400 gems left. Let's finish that on dinos. Pendulum's nutty here. I mean, I don't know much about Pendulum, but it seems pretty strong. Thanks to tier 1 Krev. You ever play Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories? Of course I did. I never speed ran Forbidden Memories, but I did play it a lot when I was a kid. Spell books in here, all right. Interesting. All right, I've spent all my gems that I got from completing the tutorial. That lasted so long. I really did get a lot of value out of those gems, man. You guys weren't wrong, it's pretty free to play friendly. Let me make that last uh, window. You still missed like 700 more from solo mode? I missed more than that, I haven't even finished solo mode. I still have two other uh, whole gates to go through. You still have the Monarch and Warriors. There's like 10 more. Oh, well, there you go. Exit Prime Shadow. Do you prefer Yu-Gi-Oh or Pokemon cards? Yu-Gi-Oh. I've collected every Yu-Gi-Oh card ever printed that's ultra rare or above in first edition. I like to bring that up every now and then because I'm really proud of the collection. It took me a long time. That's every ultra rare, secret rare, ghost rare, ultimate rare, gold rare, uh, collector's rare, starlight rare. I don't think I missed anything. Got it all. Yep. Thanks to resub old gritty. The addiction. I yeah, I literally beat the addiction by completing it. Alright. So what staples do I have? So I got Regeki, right? Do I have a favorite deck? In Duel Links I did, yeah. Thunder Dragons. But I'm gonna try doing like Dino Shadal in here, I guess. Because I had the best luck on Shadal. Oh yeah, I have one Ash. What else? Monster Reborn? I don't think that's really a staple, is it? Thanks to Resub MGK. Did you finish your Pokemon Star Collection? I haven't, but I finished my Pokemon Base Set First Ed Collection. I actually don't think I've ever showed that. Hold on, I'll show you that real quick. Kind of blasphemous to do it on Yu-Gi-Oh! Night, but here. the whole base set first ed and I got a cool little custom frame for it you can't really see it super well yep the Charizard was obviously the hardest to find but I found it on TCG player in damaged condition for like 
and it was like two grand or something, and it's a first ed, so I was like, I'm fucking taking that. And then for Yu-Gi-Oh, I'll show the Legend of Blue Eyes first ed. Yeah, I have everything from Yu-Gi-Oh. Pokemon, I only did base set. I don't know if you can see it super well. Yep. I finished my whole Yu-Gi-Oh collection. Pokemon, I still want to do the gold stars, but that's about it. Exit Prime ma Maze. In the bits top 10. I didn't get any maxi from the uh, solo mode yet, so I'll have to craft maxi. I just want to like get everything I got from solo, no crafting, and put it in here to see what I'm at. Does anyone else remember what I got? How much are those worth? I don't know, man. I wouldn't sell them. And they're not in good condition, so it's not like they grade high, and I think grading's a scam anyway. Things are tier one gray. With so many cards, don't you think some of them are fake? I was wondering about that, but I did my best to like verify they weren't. And even if they are, I mean, who's gonna come in to fucking look at my Yu-Gi-Oh and Pokemon card frames with like a magnifying glass in order to prove them to be dubious, right? Like it's, at the end of the day, I'm pretty sure they're real. I did the best I could to ensure they were. So that's good enough for me. These are tier one avalanche in the prime parvis and gift sub avalanche. Thank you, man. Oh yeah, I got lightning storm. Jesus. What else? What other staples? I need to craft maxi. I didn't get any maxi. Exit prime slinky. Mmm. Solemn judgment, right? Okay, I don't know what I was thinking. What do you think of this game par comparing it to previous titles? I think this is the best Yu-Gi-Oh game they've made. Like, official one. Bar none. Raigeki. I forgot what it is. Okay, yeah. Things of Prime Light City. Mm. Why is this the best Yu Gi Oh game? Well, one, it has like all the cards for TCG, OCG, and the format. I. I from what I understand, they're gonna also make other formats. So it'll be like a ladder for TCG and ladder for OCG. And also just like the actual duels are really flashy and cool. Thanks the Prime Hunch. Upstart Goblin. Is Upstart Goblin a, a staple? Depends. Definitely no. Most people say yes, but there's still quite a few that say no. Keep in mind, I'm running Dino Shadal. I don't see... Well, I guess I'm not knowledgeable enough on that, that combo. It's a 39 card deck. Yeah, I mean, I get that. I didn't pull any triple tactics. Okay, hear about this. Let me just sort by ultra rare. I think that was a good suggestion. That way you guys can see what I have. I know Zeus is a staple. I know I need... Are we gonna run two or three Construct? 
What kind of diamond? I know I need two window. Run three. Okay. So we'll run three construct. Damn, I thought I pulled a lot more Ultra Rares. I guess I just kept getting a lot of the same ones. Luckily, I didn't exceed three on any of them, though. That's good. Fossil Dig? Oh, yeah, two Fossil Dig. I know I need three. <clears throat> Do I want one App Cologne? This seems good, yeah. The Logia? Okay. Is this a staple? It is? Okay. I thought I pulled one more Ultra Rare El Shadal. I guess not. Oh no, it was it was the super rare one. The uh, Grishta. That's what it was. Shadal Fusion. That's super rare, isn't it? Or am I just missing it? How many should all fusion? Three. Give me the shiny one. No goat format at the moment. Can you do custom games yet? If you can do custom games, we could just set up goat format. How many schism? You can? Okay, cool. One schism. I see most people saying one. Thanks to resub, Adam. Do I want the Grista? Thanks to resub, four and diamond. No. Okay. Man, I had some kind of shit pulls on the dino side of things. What about the Shek? Okay, so miscellaneous or and baby. Is you some serious? You know what might be better? Instead of just building it with chat, maybe I'll just look one up. And then I'll put the recipe on the other side and we'll just pull cards for it. That might be best, so that way it doesn't take so fucking long. I think that's probably just gonna be how I do it, so I'm just gonna save this for now. Okay, uh, in the meantime though... Um... Well, I need to make something, because I'm not gonna win with any of the uh, starter decks. Can either of these structure decks actually win a duel? Thanks to Prime Booty. No. Fuck, man. At least in Duel Links, one of the structure decks, I think it was the uh, Ancient Gear. Like, you could beat a couple of shit players <laughs> with the with that deck. Thanks, I already said that. And thanks to the bits, Sosa. Damn, alright, um... Do more AI grinding. 
Yeah, I think that really might just be the play for now. If I had... Eh, it would be kind of worthless. I'm not going to waste gems on one of these if they're not going to actually do anything useful for me. They have public deck lists in the deck builder. Let me see. Copy from public deck. What are these based on? Just like, hey, here's some assholes that played earlier. Here's their deck. I don't know if it's any good, but here you go. This dude's doing sacred beasts. I used to five gift subs top 10, and the gift sub great. Thank you for that. Search by card. Looks like this guy spent a little bit of money here, got real lucky. So this is pure Shadal. But it's not like my dino pulls were great, so I guess I could just go pure Shadal. Invoked Sh oh you're right, I didn't even see this. Um, bro, I don't, it, it's gonna, I don't think I'll be able to get this with the 400 gems left. I don't know if I'll be able to pull all the, the remaining cards here. Invoke Shadal is top tier, is it? These are some silly. You don't have to, just craft them. I don't think I have nearly enough. Do more solos for gyms. I think that might just be the play. It's just I'd like to build something that's not the starter deck just to grind and get used to whatever deck I want. You don't have enough? Yeah, I don't think so. Thanks for your sub Saeko and saxophone. You can just dismantle the garbages. Yeah. Alright. I just don't think that's like fun to do on stream. Because that's just going to take a lot of time. I feel like that's something I'll just do tomorrow or something. Get all of that stored up. And then build the deck. And then we can learn it on stream. It's just I'd like to be able to just copy a deck quickly here. And grind a little bit with it. Even if it's not like a permanent deck. It's one click. Yeah, but it's a lot. Like, I still... There's gonna be, like, 40... Or, not probably not 40. Like, 30-something cards I'm gonna need to craft. Copy it just to see what's missing. What, from that one I was just on? Shit, okay. Okay, so, uh, a lot. Most. Here's the prime. Cryax. Ah, you, you know what I- fuck. I don't want to, but I guess what I could do just for the sake of at least getting something and getting a little grind going, I could just swipe the credit card, the most powerful card in Yu-Gi-Oh, and just- Get a little more and then craft, because I don't have enough to craft this, I'll tell you right now. Oh, no, there's no fucking way. Wait, look at all the ultra rares. Even if I did that, it'd still be like another hour or two of just opening packs. Thanks to the Prime Rosebud and the Resub Yodio. Nim. Hey, Nim. 
It's, I just had good luck on the Shadal packs, man, so I just went with Shadal. That's all. And yeah, I think Microsoft buying Blizzard's gonna be good for Blizzard games. You have the cards for pure Shadal without any other engine. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. Here. We'll just go back to this. Chat can build this deck, and if it's dog shit, I'll just blame chat. Uh, I'm not gonna do any filters. Alright. Tell me what we need, and then we'll just run with it and see how it goes. Oh yeah, here, I'll bring up the Shadal card we have. Three Windy, three Squamata. Jesus, oh my god, okay, uh, where's Windy? Oh, here's Squamata. How did I only get one Squamata? It's a normal card. Thanks the bit. Oh, I said that. Three Squamata, one Beast, two Dragon, two Falco. Mm. Two Dragon, two Falco. Okay. Wasn't Beast up here? Oh no, Dragon. Where's Beast? There it is. One Schism, one Resh. I'm assuming this one. Oh, wait. Use the shiny. Two Fox, one Slippy, two Hedgehog. Alright, I feel like we're just making shit up. Two Coca Colas, one used condom, three socks. Two number nines. <laughs> hey, what am I missing? Two Shadal. I already have the Shadal fusions. The other Shadal fusions? What the fuck is there more? This one? The Nephi? No, the other one. Jesus. What? How many fucking Shadal fusions are there? So there's this. This. That's it. The El Shadal fusion. Oh. My mic was blocking it. Okay. Got it. So is this every Shadal card I, I'll need? Because, I mean, I can make another, uh, or two Squamatas, I suppose. Here, I'll just do that now. It's normal, so this is... Fucking free. Well, actually, here, let me just do one. Three squamata is a must. Okay, I'll do one more. Double Evo pill. Alright, well, hold on first. Am I good on the Shadal side? Beast. How many more beasts? I have two. One beast, one aerial. Okay. Aerial was up here, right? Yeah, there she is. You need a hedgehog for real. Oh, 
I'm looking. Oh, here it is. Do I need Hedgehog? Two, okay. Xerisa Blama in Cookie. Hedgehog is your searcher, okay. I haven't even read these yet. Am I good on Shadals now? So, can we transition to what dinos I'm missing? One Shadal core. Thanks to Resub Tonic. Where's the Shadal core? Where did you even see that? It's a trap card. Oh. How many? You said one? Avi Raptor Miss Baby Giant. Okay. It's dog shit, don't do it. Okay, God, Jesus Christ, okay. So what else do I need from Shadal, or am I good? You're good. I would go pure Shadal. I just, I mean, if I go pure Shadal, then we're gonna need to start filling other slots. Let me, let me, okay, let me see what I have for dinos. Do I even have the Obby Raptor? I don't. Do I even have the Giant Rex? I have two. Alright, we'll, we'll try Pure Shadal then. Let's just, let's make it easier on me, I guess. I'll learn Shadal first, and then I'll try and mix and match shit in there, like Invoked and all that. Thanks to Tier 1 Lightning. Sinister Shadow Games, if you're pure Shadal. That was a trap card, right? How many? Pure Shitball. Cool, yeah. They got the fossil dig? Oh, yeah. Three. So now Shadal Core. Uh, you know, I'm just. Fuck it, I'm just been putting one in there. Is it prime? Gift sub flux. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to make. I can make two maxis here. You know, I'll do that now. I don't know. This is gonna be useful for me anyway, so I'm just gonna craft it. There. Two maxis. Oops. If you're playing maxi, you should play check. Okay. More schisms, okay. I, I haven't seen anyone say more than one, but I'll put one more in there just for the sake of it. Take out Lagia, okay. Add polymerization. Oh my god, this is 
Uh, everyone's got so many different ones in mind. It's a prime nightmare. Do I have, like, my main combos ready? Because I might just start putting in, like, hand traps. Super poly. I need super poly. That's an ultra rare. I can't make that. Okay, someone said I could just dismantle in mass somewhere. Is it this? Nope, that's not it. Like this... In Duel Links, they have the dismantle all extras. Oh, here we go. Dismantles four or more of your cards into three cards. Exit Prime, Chloe, and Nightmare. Alright. So, three Windy then? We can make the other Windy. Should all construct the Link Monster. Okay. You need one Light Monster in your deck for the combo. So, what monster? Easy tier one, Akamarin. I can't do super poly, I don't have enough ultra rare. Trick clown, I see a lot of people for trick clown. Don't have it. And I definitely don't have effect Veiler. Things to resub KQP. So yellow shield generator. Man, what the fuck? What is, what is yellow shield generator? Things a prime blurpy. I don't think that's a card you wanted. Use light swords. Let's see if I have any. I didn't get a single light sworn in any of those packs. Thanks to Prime Fabuni. Foolish Burials Ultra Rare, man. I can't make it. Whoops. Thanks to Resub Dink. There's a light Shadal. Which one's the light? Oh, here it is. Cad Shadal. It's bad, though. Uh, okay, I don't know what to replace it. Monster Reborn, because why not? Sure. This doesn't need to be perfect, by the way. It, it just needs to be usable for me right now. So, let's just fill the last six slots. I think I've got all of this squared away. So let's just fill it with cards that I have, or can quickly make. Ghost Bell. Oh yeah, I do have one of those. That was a free one. Don't have Trick Clown. Don't have MST. I don't have Call by the Grave. That was SR, I can't make it. Oh, actually it's UR. MST's free in missions. Yeah, and we can do missions, it's just I want something usable first. Forbidden chalices are rare. We got forbidden dress. Not as good, but Okay, we can make this. How many? Two? Thanks to Resub Reaper. Mystical Space Typhoons are rare, is it? Okay. Oh, 
Oh, you're right. I didn't even notice. Okay. Let's just fill it. Two. Run it. This is usable. What does this go to? Oh, let's go! Free pull! You have to have a light monster- oh, yeah, I never put a light monster in there. Well, I could have- what? It is what it is. I literally just made that. Just- okay, that's fine. Is there some pandemonium? We'll take out one chalice for a light monster. Okay, let me show you all the light monsters I have. This will be much easier that way. Here. There's the prime dingus. Cross Sheep is a good card for this. Do Warrior Lady. Okay, most people are saying Warrior Lady. Where was she? There she is. Don't have effect, Baylor. Can't make it. Okay. Neo Shadal right there. You're talking about the Cad 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 Shadal guy. Chat was saying don't do him. <clears throat> We're good. Fucking good. As long as this is usable, that's all I need right now. I'm taking it right into the, <laughs> the ranked ladder. Let's go. Never touch this shit. Don't know anything about it. Haven't even read the cards yet for Shadal. About to slap some ass. I really should have gone second. I don't know why I did that. Would have given me more time to read my cards. I also think it's better to go second, right? I drew into an ash. That's pretty good. And an upstart. Okay. What does this do? Didn't really get to set up my board super well, but uh, we'll get there. Not the best opening hand. We'll be alright. Pure Shadal is more control and combo breaking than board building. Is it? Okay. Uh, do I want to ash this? I don't know how strong Gene Raider is. I do want to ash this? Okay. Eat this shit, bitch. Ash blasted indeed. Maybe he'll just forfeit. Fuck! I'm ruined! Such a perfectly played... Ash! Uh, 
Uh, I don't think I want to solemn judgment this. This doesn't seem like amazing. Is it? Okay. What does this do again? I definitely don't want to use this yet, right? Yeah, no. Thanks to Risa Butang. So then I flip her, and then I can summon a Shadal from my deck. Okay. Yeah, most people are saying the Solemn, the Field Spell. That's the boss stage, right? The one he just drew? Oh, he didn't even play it. Do I want to use this? Don't use it, let him hit it, okay. So what's what target do I want? I want to target beast, okay. So beast is for draw, okay. And then I want it in face down, right, for the flip effect. And then I can just flip it. Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah, I haven't even read these cards yet. I've also not really seen uh, Shadal's Blade. Get Solemn Judgment, idiot! Pussy! Fucking dummy! He'll just forfeit, I already feel it. He just rage quit, flipped his table. Now, do I want to use this now just in case he just set like a Solemn or something to break my shit? Yeah? Okay, cool. What's the target for the graveyard? Does it matter? Sin Dragon. Does Dragon have a graveyard effect? Oh, okay, so I can just blast this back row with this. So, use Dragon, use Beast. How do I select both? Or do I have to select one at a time? You chain them? Okay, thanks to the resub shiv. So, here. Because in Duel Links, you just press them both during that, and then it would chain itself like that, but okay. Nah, I get it. I don't want to get rid of Schism, I don't think. I think I just get rid of Core. There's only really one guy in chat that even wanted me to have this card in the deck in the first place, so, so fuck him. Oh, don't get fucked! Whee! I am the ultimate duelist! Too easy. Oh, I stood no chance. I almost finished reading that card too.
He's a tier one girthy. And the bits dude flame. That's sweet, Tell I said thanks. And thanks to the Prime Crow. Okay. Uh, let's run it back. Let's get another one going. <clears throat> Sleep well, Cannoli. Is it Prime Luna? He's with five gift subs, Tuna. Appreciate it, man. What's oh, the best starter deck? Oh man, you're asking the wrong guy. This seems like a pretty good hand. What does Hedgehog do? It's my searcher for spells. Trap, okay. Okay. And then this is the... I didn't even get to use a second effect. So, draw two, discard one. And then if it's sent to graveyard, I draw one. Okay, so that's just good all around. Do I want to just insta Shadal Fusion? And what do I even get out of it for the Beast and Hedgehog? Let me see. One Shadal plus Earth. So I can't do the Shek. Shadal Light. Nope. Two Shadal with different attributes. Nope. Window. So I can only do Window for my Fusion target. So just wind to pass? Okay. I mean, I have an Ash in the hand as well as a Ghost Bell. She's even got an animation. Uh, what's his graveyard effect? Add a Shadal monster from deck to hand. Except Shadal Hedgehog, and then this guy's draw one. I can do both, right? So it'll just chain. There we go, yeah. Imagine I just Ash Blossom myself, just as a flex. Um... What's Falco do? And then Windy... Special Summon from the deck. I haven't used Squamata yet. Those are just target to destroy. And then I can send to Graveyard. Okay, Windy seems best, yeah. Mm. Uh, Squamata and Windy both seem good here. Please, the Reset Wolf. Yeah, we'll go Windy. Let me read Windy again. Yeah, that card's nutty. Thanks to Reflex for that. Thanks to the Prime, Elias. Whoa! What is that? Oh, is this guy playing a starter deck? His name is Wanna Girlfriend. You're not gonna get a girlfriend playing like this, nerd. Oh my lord, this is disgusting. This is disgusting. 
This is no duelist. This is an embarrassment. <laughs> well, he's just gonna discard my ash. I might as well just ash this. Get that shit out of here! Thanks for the resub, Cifferoni. Hey, there's no reason not to Ash there. He's gonna look at my hand, he's gonna get rid of Ash anyway. I might as well at least stop him from drawing. Set Squamata. Flip. Oh, we'll start with a flip. Best target's gonna be. What, what does Ariel do? Falcos, you can add a Shadal monster in your graveyard. Okay. Yeah, Falco seems pretty good here. We'll do Falco. And then set Squamata. Well. Don't set, why not? This got a little wacky. Shit. <laughs> huh. Alright, we're, we're not out of this yet. We got Schism. I mean, can't I Sinister Shadow Game, flip Squamata, kill this? I don't know what the Dark World cards are capable of. Like, should I wait on that play? Like, I don't know what's coming. Graf Grafa. I don't know Grafa. I also don't know when the best time to use Schism is. Yeah, it doesn't seem like now is the time to do anything. I'll just let this ride. Some cream pie. Oh, I don't know these cards. I mean, I think the obvious choice is this one. 
not, bro? Really? Why? This seems like it'd be much worse. He'll draw? Well, yeah, but this he gets two summons, right? He gets this guy out, and then he also gets an, another fiend monster. Window only allows one. Oh, shit! Okay, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. No, you're right. Okay. When do I want to schism? So just wait until he goes for window. Okay. So his big boss monster is Grapha. I don't I don't know that card. He knows your hand? I doubt it. Thanks for Prime Retro. I mean, I guess he could be stream sniping. I, I, I would be surprised. I definitely want to send Dragon, right? Yeah, for sure. Okay, get Dragon out. Field spell. Is it worth to kill this field spell? At least it's tier 1 Michigan. I don't know if like Gates of the Dark World work with these cards very like what it does with them. Sure, we'll just do back row. This card's about to get popped, right? Because I don't know what he targeted it with, but I'm guessing it's going to pop it, so I need to use it. I can get Construct! And then what does Shek do? I am running out of time, yeah. One Shadal plus Earth. I'm gonna do Shek. This seems like the best to me. And then... Uh, I don't want to send that. Oh my god, I'm running out. Um, Winda? What? Why, why do you keep screaming Winda? What does that mean? I'm gonna do Beast, and then the girl. God, there's so much reading. I should have read these beforehand. We're good.
should have popped the gates. Well, it wouldn't have kept the window alive. Jesus. Thanks to the five gift subs, Michigan. Okay. So now I can finally do this, right? And then I pop that, and then he stays alive. I'm going for it. I think this is the play, I don't know. So now I flip. Uh, who do I want in the graveyard? I can only use this once per turn. Where's the one that lets me draw? Who is that? Who lets me draw? Fuck, I'm out! Uh, I think it's this guy. I don't, I don't remember. Oh god, I flipped. Okay. I'm running out of time! I spent too long reading! I don't know what this effect does, but I'm using it! All right. Okay. Oh, I don't know what this effect does. Uh, just yes. I'm sure it's good. <laughs> Give me it. <a> <laughs> All right, still in it. We're in a good spot, so we get time back. Now I've read a lot of these cards. We're good. All right. Uh, I feel like MST this and attack into that. Ah, uh, fuck. I'm, I need to move fast here. This is, this is gonna go by quick. I'm taking this shit out. He might have solemn judgment. He's a prime mook. Don't blind MST. How would I search for- oh. By setting and seeing if he has an activatable. to destroy? What? Uh... Can it just be any card? How many? Oh yeah, how many? You get all the effects. Use your Shadals. Okay. Uh, what is this one again? No, you don't. Read the trap. I don't have time to read the trap. This is a lot of text, and I have to make quick decisions. I, I don't have time. I'm just gonna... Uh, what do I throw away? Just tell me, do I throw away monsters or just garbage? Just tell me that. If it's monsters, I'm just gonna start tossing shadows. Not monsters. Got it. All I needed to hear. Okay, uh... Don't want to set a Windy or a Skamata? Hi, Skamata. Thanks to Resub QB and Tier 1 Anos. Fuck, fuck, I can't decide. Oh my god, I don't even know what this card does! Oh my god. Uh, 
I'm not playing it, I'm just gonna attack. I, I can't- I don't have time to read. Jesus, fuck. So I can't attack with that, which is fine. I just need it on the field as a big body. Nah, it's not even- it, 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 Is it worth? Uh, I can't decide if it's worth. Uh, okay, it's not worth. I'm just gonna say it's not worth. Okay. Alright. Well, I can't read it on their turn because I also have decisions to make with Sinister Shadow Game. Well, I'll have plenty of time to read it, actually. Do I want to just kill this, Squamata, and then swing for game? I think... I mean, I, I think... Or just let it ride. I feel like either one works. I don't think he has anything left. I'm just gonna do it, just because it's in my head. If I lose here, it's fucking fine. I don't care. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna cry about it. And then I'm gonna pop this in the back row. Okay. To me, this seems like the safer play. Let's go! Fuck yeah! God damn! The, like it, it's less of like a duel and more of a like a speed reading section on the SATs, man. Like I feel like I'm taking a test. Ah, but we got there, and that last play was a red solo cup original right there. I I crafted that one. <clears throat> oh shit! Thanks to Tier One Anos and the resub Nunyo and the five gift subs a year, the resub Luzion. Alright, I feel like I learned a lot about the deck, though. Here's a resub spade. Okay. That was pretty... It, I wouldn't say smooth. But it could have been a lot worse. I even have a nice win streak cooking up. Thanks to the resub muffin. And the tier one DeBarrow. Surrender streak? Well, it was lethal on the next turn. And the duel before that, that guy was kind of fucked. Okay, let me take a tinkle real quick. I'll be right back.
Nice. All right, let's do some solo. Get some more gems. These are prime drowned demons. Oh, there's lore around the monarchs. Are monarchs useful? Because I remember like Mobius, Zaborg. They're pretty good. Nice. Caius. Oh, I forgot about Erebus. Thanks to the resub Jackson. Hey, I was just talking about Mobius. Wait, this soundtrack kind of slapping. I remember him from Duel Links. The music's so good, the choir, yeah. Thanks for the bits, grown-ass adult. I know I can click the rabbit. There's also other shit around the map I know I can click to interact with. I still don't get how this game works. I mean, it's a free game and it teaches you how to play it. But this, without a doubt, I would say is like the most complicated card game. Like, magic is super deep, but I think this is on just a different level. Just look at the text on some of these cards, man. And then you get to like pendulum and it, oh my god. Exit tier one, zero. With magic, there's like streamlined abilities, so you get things that you know what they do, like a haste, for example, or you know, flying. You know, that extends across everything. All of these cards, 
Like, while they'll do similar things to each other, it still explains it in, like, 17 sentences, and there's something different about it somewhere in there. That makes it function a little different. What is this? Bring me the squire. to use this effect right now oh wait yeah it absolutely it goes to my hand Fuck. and then I can get those back right um one of these searches from the graveyard, right? If I remember correctly. Which one of these gets from the graveyard? God damn it. Can someone just tell me? Who searches a spell or trap from the graveyard? None of them? I thought one of them did. Uh, I already have Erebus in my hand. Idia gets you one from the Banish Zone. Is that what I'm thinking of? Yeah. Alright. I'm summoning one, but he goes back to my hand. And I thought one of them searched for a spell or trap, because I was going to grab the... Uh, I think it was a field spell I threw away. Or a field spell. Hard to say, grown-ass. I'd say probably sex. Just choose your favorite flavor. Yeah, I'll grab the Shadow Monarch. I always thought he was... I always thought he was cool. Okay, I guess he was in my hand. Oh no. There was Erebus in my hand. about to get fucked. This card's limited to one, right? The reinforcements. Grave effect? What was a grave effect? Is it one of these? Reveal three monarchs from your deck. Okay, yeah. 
Oh, this guy, wait, he also has a graveyard effect? Well. I don't even know why I'm bothering to read these so much. This is just like a practice duel. I don't think I'm going to be running Monarchs. But these are just cool. It's good to know what your opponent can do. I don't think anyone's going to be running these. Unfortunately, let's get. Well, what does Erebus do? Let's get Erebus out there. Well, that was dumb. Wait, I thought I got to choose. Oh my god. I thought I got to choose to send that back. Fuck! Alright, alright, right, whatever. I don't know why I'm overthinking this so much. Well. It's on me. Tier 1, all gas, no brakes. Rip that channel. But channel 5's even better. Like a phoenix rising from its ashes. What is his effect again? I already I keep forgetting. Oh, I just sent two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, probably not worth. Eh, it probably is. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep using effects till I figure out what the what these monarchs do. Then I'll just send that. I'll bring in. I'll bring Mobius. Right. We're good. We're figuring it out. What is. What the fuck? What is this effect? What is this quick effect? All right, use it. And then give me... Uh... <laughs> Jesus. Give me this guy again. 
Welcome back, Erebus. Alright. This is a fucking practice duel, and there's so much reading on these monarchs. I know how Thunder Dragons work, though. NPC must have bricked. That's probably what it is. Okay, now we're cooking. What does this guy do again? It, it doesn't matter. There's nothing I can really do besides just attack. I mean, there is more I could do, but it wouldn't be smart. Cooking. Thanks for the resub, Lucas. What does this do? All right, huge. And now we swing for lethal. Wait, what is his effect? Ah! Oh, no, 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 no. Yes. There we go. I'm learning. I see how they work now. What? Why am I banishing a- Fuck! I have to? It's it's not an option? Whatever, just get it. It's already game, just get it out of here. Calculated for the extra burn damage. And easy. Fuck me, those monarchs have a lot of moving parts to them. Holy shit. Thanks to tier one, I Sid. Why is this locked? Oh, I don't have enough. He thinks monarchs are complicated. I do. They are complicated. Fucking a lot of tribute summon options. Things to give some wax rod. Shadal's felt more intuitive. Things to resub road. So much lore. He's a gift sub Jordan. So this is the monarch one. Hey, Element Saber. I remember for just a little while in Duel Links, these guys were kind of nutty. I think they were almost tier one back in the day. They had a uh, Element Saber guy whose name starts with an M, like Mordow or whatever. 
Quick effect, flip defense. Pretty... Pretty fucking strong in Duel Links. Yeah, Molyhu, that's who it was. Along with Invoked and Cockatus. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit was scary. Oh, hey, yeah, you're right, I did unlock more. Holy shit, a lot more. Nice! So far, really impressed with the game, man. I really hope Konami gives this the uh, tender love and care it needs to thrive. I'm, I think it's fucking good. Now I just need to master some decks. And then learn pendulums and links. <clears throat> Is the game pay to win? I haven't spent a dime, and I built a usable Shadal deck. They seem pretty generous with the uh, missions and the solo mode. Is Shadal a secret pack? Yeah. Here's a gift sub, Jordan. Will you moist meter it? I might. See, like, I just got another 1800, or, well, I got 1200 gems. Just from doing solo mode and uh, completing the missions. Your packs were kind of nutty. They were. You know what? Let's keep riding the momentum. Might as well finish my gems off for tonight. Uh, what do I need? Thanks for the bits, Chemical Panda. I want to just search for staples. Oh, Numeron's in there. Oh! Eldritch. Remember him being very good. Nah, nothing specific, just staple cards, like Effect Veiler. Where's Effect Veiler? What secret pack is he in? You craft staples in this. True, yeah, I guess that would be a better use, to be fair. Oh, he's actually in none of them. Oh, because none of the staples are in secret packs. Oh, you're literally just saying they don't exist in there. I see. Gotcha. I do still eventually want to build a fun ninja deck. The Dogmatic Secret Pack is especially good for Shadal. Okay, so just craft an Ecclesia. Okay, fine. Big pull. Big pull. Ooh. Might be a huge pull. This could be massive. Hey. Not bad. Oh, and it even got me a new card pack, too. Let's go. My pulls have actually been kind of gross. Thanks, give sub Jordan. I'm feeling good here. Nothing but fat ultra rares. Thanks, Resub Mob. Okay, that's not wonderful, but it's, you know, we take it, we take it. Kind of absolutely massive coming up. I don't know either of those. Thanks to the Prime Alexander. Punishment's good. Hey, Tri Brigade, I know that one. That's from, um. Not Rise of the Duelist. What came after Rise of the Duelist?
Phantom Raid, yeah, yeah, yeah. Things are a bit all gersty. Damn. Oh, still SRs. Got lucky. Pretty good streak. SR in every pack. Check your dual pass. Oh yeah, I gotta do that. Thanks if you sub car sec. Ooh, let's go! Huge! Floridy. That's how you say it, right? Floridelli. Whatever the fuck. Floor de Lee. Floor de Lee. That's what it is. Now, is there pure Dogmatica decks? Because I thought they were mainly just used kind of like Invocation. Just good in other decks. Not pure? Okay. Dogmatic is an engine. Ah, gotcha. I got an SR in every single pack here. Fucking big. And we got more secret packs. Very nice, very nice. Okay, let's check my dual pass. Another mission complete too. This is a mobile game. I think it's coming to mobile, but right now it's PC and console. Where's my dual pass? There it is. All right, we got enough for 10 more packs, baby. Let's go, let's go this again. We're riding momentum right now. We got a super rare in every single one. Streak has continued. Nadir Servant is the big ticket item. Yeah, I know Nadir is pretty good. Is Triple Tactics talent in this one as well? Damn. Or is that going to be a different pack? Thanks for the gift sub again, Jordan. Damn, streak really got broken. <laughs> oh, we're hitting a rough patch. There we go, we're back in it. What the fuck is this thing? A, like a whack-a-mole set? Is this useful in anything? Springins? I've never even heard of that archetype. Oh wait, this is used for Albaz? It's a meme strategy. Ah. This is exactly what I'm fucking talking about, though. Look at all the text on this, on this card. So much! Man, pendulums... It, fuck, man. What a pain in the ass. Yeah, I got really unlucky on this, uh... This 10 pack. I know that's not the worst one. Endymion's the worst one, right? Endymion is actually like 500 words. It's like a full blown essay.
Alright, yeah, now I get a guaranteed ultra rare in the next 10. Because this was trash. Tough. These are five gift subs, eye candy. Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Oh, alright. I think I'm gonna call it a night. This was good! I'm gonna start building some shit out. Oh, and start climbing. Alright everyone, thanks for tuning in. To everyone who donated, big thank you. New subs, welcome aboard. Sub means a lot, so thank you for subbing. I hope you enjoy the emotes, and I will see you all tomorrow. Uh, let me see. I think I'll toss you to another Yu-Gi-Oh! stream. Let me see who's doing Master Duel. I'll toss you to... I see Duel Link's meta is still going. Oh, the Duel Logs is streaming. I watch the Duel Logs on YouTube. I'll toss you to Duel Logs tonight. I've tossed you to Duel Links before. I've never sent you to Duel Logs. Alright, thanks again everyone, and I will see you tomorrow. And thanks to the reset, Find.